New at 9 on this Father's Day weekend, the local nonprofit Birthright Living Legacy is honoring dads going above and beyond. Fox 23's Amy Hybels has a preview. We are getting ready for the Super Bowl of fatherhood to be able to celebrate the fathers that are doing the right thing all year long. And they're nominated by their friends, their family, their peers to be able to be highlighted for all the hard work that they're doing. On Saturday night, five fathers out of 59 who were nominated will be honored at a gala for the positive impact they're having on their families. The Tulsa nonprofit Birthright Living Legacy says its mission is to celebrate and support fathers by equipping them with the tools and resources to lead successful families. Executive Director Marquise Dennis says the biggest takeaway after completing the coursework is that the men have been able to accept the fact that they don't have to be perfect. The more that they can be their authentic selves, that helps their kids have a lot of security, a lot of just joy to be able to know that they are made in a very unique way. And when they go into schools and when they go into workplaces, fully confident in knowing who they are and whose they are, it helps them to be able to contribute in a way that normally they, know, they, they never will. <laughs> Married father of two, Timothy Butler, has been taking part in the nonprofit's courageous meetings for men for the past seven months. I've learned the importance of adding to your love bank and setting the atmosphere for your house as a man. Now you have to learn, okay, do I want to be right or do I want to be righteous? Butler and his wife Brandy will be celebrating their 10-year wedding anniversary in October. Both have their master's degrees and co-own a business. As a spouse, Brandy says she recognizes the importance of men supporting one another. When it comes to fathers and men being together, they understand the unique problems that, pro that fathers have and men have, you know, in that dynamic. The Butlers say they plan to attend the Saturday night celebration honoring fatherhood. In Tulsa, covering news that matters, I'm Amy Heibels, Fox 23 News.